New, new, new. That is the word of the city of Evansville. Mayor Lloyd Winnicky shares the wonderful new projects with us. Oh, my goodness. That's quite a list. Do you need it? No, no, <laughs> there no. There's so many. You can prompt me. Yeah. Well, you know, we see, because I'm downtown all the time, I live there, the development up North Main Street in the new apartment complex, the Forge, and now we're going to be feeding those folks in a way that's been needed for so long. Yeah, we're really grateful. Uh, we've been working on finding a grocer for that North Main area, Jacobsville, which is in one of our food deserts in the right. city. And it's taken months and months and months. Um, Carl Chapman has run point on this for the city along with uh, House, develop House Investments, the developer of the block. Um, but we're really proud that um, uh, Dollar DG Market uh, which is a uh, arm of Dollar General will go in there. They'll offer fresh meat, fresh produce, fresh vegetables. It will be uh, a really nice addition to that wonderful 180-unit apartment complex that sits right there on North Main. Is it opposite that? I mean, if I'm looking, if I'm coming up North Main and the apartments to my left, is it the next block over? No, it's in that building. Oh, it's, it's in the building. Yeah, so okay. it's on the first floor. There's a, they're taking about 11,000 square feet of uh, of that uh, of the forge. Right there on North Lloyd, Main. that's so exciting. Yeah, yeah, it's and really super cool. For all cool. of us, yeah. I mean, down there, we'll take advantage it's a, it's of that. It's a big win. What is the, uh, how full is the forge right now? Because I see lots of folks moving Yeah, there. Are, I, I don't, I can't tell you the exact occupancy rate, but I have been told that uh, they're they're renting quickly. So we're really, really grateful for the, the good work that's going on there. It, and it looks, it's a good looking yeah, facility as well. so much better than what it did before. Oh, of course, right. <laughs> Great to have more people. We need more people. Exactly. So pickleball is crazy. I mean, it's, oh we're, we're, we do pickleball here. So <laughs> we have Well, then reports. you'll love this, this announcement. So. Uh, we are really excited. The designs for a pickleball addition to Wesselman Park. This will be adjacent to the tennis courts. So there's a nice, flat, green spot that's open, and 24 pickleball courts will go in there. We'd like to. We think that the designs will be the design will work will be complete by the end of this year. Uh, construction will begin shortly thereafter. It's about a four or five month construction period. So all goes right. You know, mid next year, we'll be cutting a ribbon on a nice new pickleball facility at Wesselman. Well, there's so many teams, so they'll be happy. So you and Ron can bring your rackets and come on. Yeah, over. yeah, because you know we're, we're pickleball crazy. I'm kidding, but so many of my friends play. I mean, they're really fierce about this. Yeah, too. it's hot. It's it's <laughs> it's really hot. That and disc golf. Yeah, I, I'm a big golfer golfer. Yes. I have trouble with disc golf. It's that, well, I think it's a learning curve. It, yeah, <laughs> very much so. Well, and also new, skate park. We've been working on this for many years, and uh, we really appreciate the good work of a lot of uh, young people, and young people who are uh, young at heart, who are really skate enthusiasts, that have really pushed us to, uh, we initially thought we would put a skate park at Roberts Park, but now uh, we know it's now going to go on the riverfront. So between uh, Mickey's Kingdom and the new Sunrise Pump Station, we'll break ground on that, uh, we believe, in November. And that construction period is not long also. So I would suspect, again, sometime mid-year, we'll be able to cut a ribbon on a new skate park right there on the riverfront. So think about the activated green space that you'll have and just, you know, really literally from Mickey's Kingdom to the pump station because once the pump station opens, that, all that green space opens to the public, there are big swings up there. So you'll be able to go up and sit on a swing and watch the river go by. You'll be able to see the treated water go back into the river through this beautiful cascade. It will be a really great addition and a great amenity for the downtown area. So much new, 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 and new, more new, to come. Yes. Thank you. Yes. We'll be back with more local lifestyles right after this.